Hey guys, it's Big Dave here for Tales of Talara, and it's Monday, and you know that means it's time for Warfronts. This week on Warfronts, it's my level 50 mage, my pyromancer, dominator, spect, mage. This is Whitefall Steps. It is the weekend Warfront, so you know that means it's escalation time. I'm gonna collect some shards and power up our cannon. So I'm back from my computer issues. Thank you to everybody who expressed concern. Thank you to Terran698, who gave me a good tip, which is actually something I did in the process of repasting my uh, my processor. Just went ahead and, and went through with that. It was a terrifying experience, uh, but everything seems better. Computer performance is occasionally a little sluggish. My trackpad doesn't work anymore, and my lit keyboard is no longer lit. But other than that, everything is fine. So as I grab this shard, let's go ahead and get into the show. This week's theme is going to be coming back to level 50. I've been playing a lot on my level 40, uh, 41 rogue lately. In fact, the last three or four episodes have been uh, on my rogue, and I'm coming back to level 50 for the first time in a while, really, and I gotta say, I'm not liking it. Uh, I'm really not enjoying level 50 PvP, to the point where I think I'm going to say uh, I'm done with it for right now. Uh, I am no longer going to play my mage in level 50 PvP at this point, uh, I am going to endeavor to level my rogue up and try him maybe a little bit in level 50 PvP, but right now I'm just disillusioned with level 50 PvP in general. I played about six matches prior to this game, and they were all absolute one-sided stomp fests, which generally tends to be how things seem to go when it comes to level 50 PvP these days. Uh, but I really wasn't happy, I really wasn't enjoying myself, and so... Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm not going to do level 50 PvP anymore, uh, at least not for a few weeks, not until I can get my uh, my rogue leveled up, my bard, into the level 50 range. So I'm going to replace my mage on the show with either my warrior or my cleric. Both of them are in their 20s. Uh, if you have a feeling either way to which one you would like to see, you can let me know in the comments below. But otherwise, you're going to stop seeing this guy uh, for quite some time. I may sort of uh, dawdle around with him in Conquest, which, you know, some people say it's great, some people say it's not so great. Uh, we'll see. You know, I'll give it a try. I may post some videos independent of Warfronts that involve uh, a look at the Conquest mode, as I am really excited about that. I've really only had the computer recovered for about a day now. Uh, well, that's not actually true. I've had it for a few days, but I had some work around the house, had to paint and uh, move a bunch of furniture around, and oh, woe is me, right? I'm complaining about owning a house and having to, <laughs> and the stress of having to do home improvements to my house that I own. So, uh, yeah, first world problems, right? But uh, anyway, it kept me from doing the things that I wanted to do for my weekend, like playing Rift or other games. So, uh, yeah, I'm crying about it. So, uh, again, I haven't gotten a chance to, to try Conquest, uh, but uh, I, I'm really excited to try it. I, I know uh, some people have said, eh, not so great, but uh, we'll see. We'll see what's going on, and you may see this rogue, or this mage, excuse me, in the, uh, in the Conquest videos. Otherwise, you're going to see my rogue as sort of the star of Warfronts, and he has been the star for the last several weeks. And uh, you will see either my warrior or my cleric. I'm not sure which one yet uh, that I want to do, so you guys feel free to weigh in on that, as I just said. So why exactly am I not feeling level 50 right now? Well, I think part of it is I have such a limited amount of time in which to play this game. And when I look at the grind, you know, the, the prestige grind, the rank grind with a level 50 character, I'm not just, I'm, I'm not feeling it. I'm not enthusiastic about that. I'm not enthusiastic about the time that it's going to take me to close the gear gap to all of these people that I'm already playing against. And I know that's not going to change when I'm on my rogue, uh, but uh, I can get a few weeks away from it and away from the stresses of that, of, of just feeling inadequate. And also, I'm not really feeling the, the mage in general. He's kind of... I don't know. I loved him in PvE, but he's really turned out to be sort of not my style in PvP. Uh, I do like some of the stuff that I've done with him, some of the specs... Uh, I did enjoy my Necromancer stuff, but that doesn't seem all that viable uh, in PvP. So, uh, you know, I may do some more research and eventually come back to him further down the road, but, but right now this is kind of where I am and I, I, where I'm at, and I'm kind of happy with it. You know, I'm kind of happy with the idea that uh, I'm not going to be playing this, this character in, uh, in level 50 PvP anymore. I, I think the thing that I was really in danger of is continuing to push this character and play in these games that end up being kind of one-sided, uh, you know, this is actually a somewhat even game, which is why I used it out of all the clips that I had. But, uh, you know, playing in all these one-sided beatdowns and, and even the one-sided victories, I was afraid that I would get disillusioned with PvP in general. 
and that was something that I really didn't want to do. And also just noticing how different it feels to come into a level 50 game versus a game in the 20s, 30s, or 40s brackets. And it isn't just that, you know, in the 30s and 40s some people don't know what they're doing and you can kind of take advantage of that. It's just that overall feeling. It, there's just a feeling of, I don't know, a, a lack of seriousness, a feeling of, of just sort of general enthusiasm by the by the people that are playing there like they don't really care they run around they do crazy stuff and you know sometimes they do the wrong things sometimes they do the right to do the right things whatever but it seems like everybody's just kind of there to have a little bit of fun a little bit of diversion as they're leveling up uh, but that's kind of what i enjoy about pvp i enjoy pvp as a secondary activity and when you hit level 50 it is kind of the thing, like you have to dedicate yourself to it, and it, it started to feel for me almost like I was a raider, you know, <laughs> raiding again and having to dedicate myself to getting all of, of this gear and, 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 and getting all this knowledge, and I don't know, it was fun, but not that much fun, and it slowly got less fun as we take the, the victory here. But uh, that's not really what I want out of my, my game time when I play this game. I want to come in, I want to enjoy myself, I want to be able to pop in for, for five or six matches and then go away. And not worry that I'm so undergeared that I just can't cut it. So uh, for those reasons, if I even articulated them very well, for those reasons I am going to put level 50 PvP with my mage on hold for now. I will explore Conquest with him, as well as some other stuff like, uh, you know, the new instant adventures, the ranking down stuff. There's a lot of really fun stuff going on right now for, for leveling characters, and I want to do sort of a ramblings video about that in the next week or two, uh, where I kind of talk about my experiences leveling up on some of my uh, alts, and uh, that's really where I'm, where I'm enjoying myself right now, on the lower level content and the lower level war fronts. So, uh, I am taking my leave for from level 50 PvP for the next several weeks, at least until my rogue gets there. Once my rogue gets there, I feel that there are several different specs that I would like to explore in level 50 PvP. So we'll get a good chance to do that with the rogue. And uh, for now, we're going to say goodbye to Narm, my very first level 50 character, and my number one man here, my first character I ever created. And we are going to put him into the closet, at least, well, not not the closet where you're pretending not to be homosexual, the closet where you're stored until you're, until you're needed. Um, right, probably should just go ahead and end this right now, because it's just starting to spiral down into a fiery wreck. So, uh, yeah. All right, guys, thanks for tuning in. I'm, I'm back on track with Warfronts. I'm happy to be back on track with Warfronts. Expect footage from my rogue next week, probably playing Bard. If you, if you care one way or the other, whether I start using my warrior or my cleric in future episodes, let me know in the comments below. Thanks for all the encouragement, guys. Thanks for sticking with me. And until next time, take it easy.